So you can see this giant sign over here letting everybody know exactly where we are. It's the biggest billboard in town. It's pretty funny, the first time that I drove up to the campus, uh, I literally missed the turn. I mean, if you take a look at this, when you turn here, it's like your choice. Do you want to drive into someone's driveway or do you want to brave this dark alley that leads down to a pawn shop? I mean, it's crazy. It's mind blowing because every single week people drive down this road and pull into this parking lot and see what is the craziest building I've ever seen in my life. And yet they walk in and, um, and this is all God needs to meet them right where they are and to change lives. So it's pretty humbling. Pretty awesome reminder of just how good he is. So uh, we'll have, we will have Jim, Nick, Carlton, we'll have you waving with a smile. Sound good, my friend? You guys rock it out. All right, host team on three. One, two, three, host, host team, three. let's go. Awesome, guys. Good morning, sir. How we doing? Good. Yes, yes. Good morning. I've been serving, I would say, almost a whole year. I'm just excited that the new church should be way bigger than this one. And also, I can't wait because I got baptized, so my picture is actually hanging inside the, the new church. So I can't wait to go see it. Roger that. Uh, and I just informed the officers that we might have to throw down more seats because of this getting full, baby. So I'm about to close out the last experience in this building. Man, this place is gonna erupt afterwards because we're gonna break everything down and celebrate and get ready to move into this brand new building. I can't wait, man. I'm gonna go close this thing out. This is the last experience here in this building. I'll tell you, it has been exciting, which it definitely has. The best is yet to come. I can't wait for next weekend. And the reason why is not because we're moving in a new building, it's because we're going to reach more people. I can't wait to meet your family members, your friends, your loved ones as you bring them with you. Don't forget that God doesn't need a brand new building to change lives, right? He just needs people who are fully devoted to following him, who are loving people in this community and inviting them like crazy to experience everything we've invited. I love you guys, I appreciate you. You may stand to your feet. Let's do this right. Let me hear you loud and proud, whoever finds God. All right, love you guys, see you soon. Should be all done back there. We should be looking good in that hallway. I'm really excited because what's actually happening is we're moving out stuff that's going to our new building, and then we're getting stuff ready for other churches to utilize, which is really exciting because we have so many local churches, uh, Connecticut, downstate New York, even Canada, that come to just kind of see how we do things. And any chance we get, we want to resource them. So this is like jackpot. Listen, we got to get to work, okay? Good stuff right here. Yeah, 8.15, meet at the new campus, ready to roll. Yes. But day one is a wrap. Yeah! <laughs>